Hey, what's up guys? I have a Halloween type, steelbook type dealio unboxing here for you. Um, this is one of the, I think, how many was released? It was four, I think, steelbooks from Best Buy? Five, six? There's like a bunch of steelbooks released. Now, today is um, October 2nd, and it's just steelbook day here in the fall of 2018. There's, I, I swear to God, there's... There's Beetlejuice, there's The Shining, there's uh, Salem's Lot, there's uh, Sicario 2, there's um, Beetlejuice, obviously, and there's like three more that, uh, Steelbooks that are releasing today. There's more FYE exclusive ones, too. I think The Goonies and and um, um, It, Stephen King's It. I think that's at Best Buy, too. There's Steelbook, it's a, it's a bonanza out there. It's Steelbooks galore. It's crazy. Um, I did not buy all of them, but I bought a bunch of them, and you're going to see them on this channel. But this is the first one, uh, Beetlejuice, which, um, yeah, pretty cool. I've actually, like, confession time, I've never seen this whole film, seriously. And I know that's, like, sacrilegious and whatnot, but I have never actually seen this film. I honestly, again, if I'm being honest, never cared for the way his character looked, Michael Keaton. I don't know, it just, it just kind of bugged me. But I have it now. And I didn't own the film, and I thought for 12 bucks, buying it now and having the steelbook for him, that sounded cool. So here it is. I bought it, and we're going to look at it right now. So this is, um, I don't think this, I bought this from Best Buy. I don't know if it's an exclusive. I th it might be an exclusive, but who the hell knows. F um, FYE announced a bunch of steelbooks they were releasing on the exact same day. And a couple of them were doubles from Best Buy, so I have no idea if, if Beetlejuice was among them. And there's his weird head there. Look at that guy. The weirdo. It's Matt, by the way. It's Matt um, Finish. Oh, it's a little sticky right there. Looks okay. I don't see dings or scratches or dents. No spine slash. That's cool. Let's get this glue off of here. have us a look-see. Uproarious, uproarious, oh my god, I can't even fucking speak. Uproarious, irresistible, a dazzling display of director Tim Burton's unique pop culture sensibility. This is a Tim Burton, okay, start over. Tim Burton, from 1988, yep, I thought so. Here lies Betelgeuse. I guess I haven't seen the film, so I have no idea if that's right. Um, what else they got here? Special, fe special features. I just cannot talk today. Three hilarious episodes from the animated Beetlejuice TV series. Uh, those are the episode titles, I think. And then a trailer. I guess that's kind of cool if you're into the series. Um, we're looking at here. Danny Elfman, of course. Let's just do this here. Uh, I may as well read this. What is, what's a yuppie ghost couple, Gina Davis and Alec Baldwin, to do when their quaint New England home is overrun by trendy New Yorkers? Hire a freelance bio-exorcist to spook the intruders, of course. As directed by Tim Burton, Michael Keaton's Beetlejuice is one of the biggest, baddest wolves a ghost movie has ever unleashed. A poltergeist. The Village Voice. Keaton's work in this and Clean and Sober won him 1988's National Society of Film Critics Best Actor Award. Rona Ryder, Catherine O'Hara, Jeffrey Jones, and Sylvia Sidney share starring honors along with wondrous production design, Harry Belafonte soundtrack tunes, and its Oscar-winning best makeup. Cool. It's Rona Ryder, right? Did I just see her name? Yeah. It's funny, actually. I, I get, because this is, what year is this? This is after, um, right? Is this after? Um, uh, uh Edward Scissorhands? No, that was in like 1990, wasn't it? This is before Edward Scissorhands. Right? Yeah. Because Leonard Ryder is in that, and I would get them, because I feel like stylistically these look very similar. Uh, Edward Scissorhands and um, Beetlejuice. I believe that's because it's the same fucking team that did it. Um, but um, I always got that confused for whatever reason. Anyway, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? Did I open this up yet? I don't think I did. <laughs> There's the disc. Very plain a clear disc from uh, Warner Brothers. 
And then there's Michael Keaton on the inside being fucking weird. What the fuck? 1988. Cool beans. Let's save this. Like I said, I don't have any things, anything special to say about it because I haven't seen the fucking film. Um, so, I, you know, sorry. <laughs> But uh, I am planning on watching it now that I have it. I'll, I'll watch it this month at some point. And uh, I actually am looking forward to it now. Beetlejuice. Let's see. One over this one. Cool. Yeah. Very simple, but uh, I'm down with it. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I have more Steelbooks coming, and I will get on to looking at those right now. I actually have a couple more to look at right now. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you later. Bye.